Probably the highest quarter court we've raided. This was one of my favourite courts. I wonder if we still as awesome as I remember. Come on, yeah, it is. yeah. Last time we came to the wall, we just hit 100 subscribers. We're coming back and we have just hit 222 subscribers and we're back at the court. Oh man, this, it's still as awesome as ever. Hey, watch this. That's some good puddle ball. I'd like to know who the artist is that did this. Oh, it might be written. Cobble Park has a wall with no art. It's full court, which is cool. It's got two rooms. It's got this awesome wall. Another park we went to straight after this has a wall of the exact same setup. So this place here is in the middle of like all these houses. They look really nice and peaceful and calm and it's got this massive park. And then we come here and start bouncing the ball. Ned on upside down had a wall. Roto Park. So, did you want to clean the ball? He doesn't like the stickiness of this ball. Uh. <laughs> you want me to do it? What? This possibly could have been flooded too in the Queensland floods. This little wall and it's got lines through point lines. Oh, this is actually very unique. No, I don't want that. That's slobber. Oh, yuck. Yuck. Now that's what I'm grossed about. This is awesome. Ah. I thought this was going to be terrible. You're not worried about the ball? Well, that's got sliver in it. Why do you think it's on that? It's a quarter and a bit. It's got a bonus bit here, which I'm pretty happy about. Yeah. And it has a wall. Lunch. I'm sure it's duck saliva. No, oh, duck poo. Yeah, oh, now yeah. watch it. So have you ever put on a net wrong? With that net, throws the whole thing off. It's a terrible net. And the pole is well secured and structured. This is that angled attachment point. Galvanized metal. I think these bend after a while. And have you ever put on your underwear wrong? It's the same theory, really. I love the lines. They are yellow, they are bold, they are seemingly correct. They've got the key, they've got the boundaries. Full three point line. This is the surface, it's uh, concrete slabs. Look, it's probably about the minimum level of playability. Standard rim with those standard loops. I'm going with a six. I'd give it a five. Five yeah. and a half, five and a half. I tell you what, it's got an extra half on it, so I'll give you that half. I think it's Galileon? Galileon? What are you saying? We could uh, get Gotta Hoop them all pin drop logos on them? The wall's a 10 out of 10. Because of the incredible graphic on it, you love it. It's only a quarter court, comes to the three point line, and then just that little bit beyond, sort of inbound the ball after a foul, sort of that sort of area. It's just enough for a three on three size. It does go all the way to the wings, full quarter court. Next, we're looking at the rim, fantastic wave rim. Someone just showed up here. I'm sure they wanted to play, and then they watched for a while and left. They're probably going to the forest. I'm gonna give this court a one. Terrible court. So we're leaving. Well, we're sorry if we send you to the forest. Next is the backboard. It's the tiny little backboard. You get the wall, but you get the small backboard. It's on one of these older curved pole structures, but you know, it's it's adequate for what it is. The net, because it's on the wave rim here, this net looks brand new. Is we've got to get into the surface. It is a concrete slabs. Uh, they've designed it in a way that, yeah, you can drive right into the hoop and you won't trip on anything. The three point line is what I'd say the high school distance. And this court, has dedicated opening and closing hours at 6 p.m. It opens at 6 a.m. It has been spray painted in all four corners. I think you'd go to jail if you uh, came here before or after six. 16 basketballs here. I went out to just go get a training mat and came back with 16. Actually, it was a dude that even rocked up and it's like 10 o'clock on a Friday. This is your home court. Let us know in the comments what you would rate it. We definitely recommend 7.5 for a quarter court. It's probably the highest quarter court we've rated. The only recommendation I have is um, bigger backboard, thanks. I need a bathroom, this place would get another point if I had one. <laughs>